Welcome back, survivors. The Storm Z here. And we are back in Imperion. And I have been working on the base, guys. So we got a little bit of stuff done. Not a whole lot yet. But our little entryway room, it's a little bit bigger. I moved the... Well, I didn't move, but the constructor's over here. And... I got a constructor box, a temporary constructor box, up and running. We got our little junk box right here, weapons and building stuff, you know, all that. We got that set up. Uh, we are working on a power slash storage room. Now, right now being limited on the amount of stuff we can build. I'm not going to get too fancy with it. I'm just going to throw stuff in. But I have started working on it. Now, first, I want to come out here. We're going to drone out again. And I want to show you all that I have been building little defensive installations. So we got a gun here. And over here on this side, we have another gun. Little gun emplacements. I like it. I think it looks cool. I'll show y'all again once it becomes daytime because it's kind of hard to see, especially with my dude's light. There we go. Now we can see a little bit better. So we got that. And I know y'all are probably wondering, why do we, are we missing a solar panel? Well, this is where our new room is going to be. Down here for our all of our solar, our oxygen, our fuel, our generator, and some of our storage is going to go down here. Now, turn my light back on. Uh, <laughs> now, I'm going to have the entrance to it right here. And this is where I am at now. This is what I'm working on. Yay, I had just enough. Good. Well, now that we got that entrance done... I'm going to go ahead, fly up, and I'm going to replace our uh, our solar panel. But I am going to wall this off. I have walled it off behind each and every one of the solar panels. So, it is its own room, basically. There we go. Good. So, anyway, here we are. Very, very basic setup. Nothing fancy. Um, can I not get a block into this? Ooh, I can. Yay! So anyway, I'm not exactly sure how far back I want to go with, like, our boxes and our storage and, you know, all that kind of stuff. But I do want to get them in. And I need to get our ammo box in. Which. Right there. We got some extensions made up. Alright. So what I'm thinking for right now. Because we do have a decent amount of uh, space. Is I'm going to set up three different boxes. Come on, get them up there. Like so. Alright, now that will give us what? Let's see, let's grab one of those. That gives us 48,000. Wait, no, that's the one up top. Hold up, that wasn't the one I wanted. Oh, they are all 48,000. Okay, so each container at the moment is at 48,000. Uh, that's not bad, but it is going to... We're going to need a little bit more. I can guarantee you that. I can already guarantee that. That's alright, though. I want to come over here, and I want to put down the ammo box. And really, I only need, like, two. Two things, I think. Two things should be more than enough. I don't see any reason why, uh, why we need that much ammo. But anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and add 
A second row. Okay, so we're one box short over there. We'll just grab this other box real quick. There we go. And... There. Okay, so now... All of our boxes down here are 88,000, which is so much better. Now, are they going to get bigger than this? Yes, most definitely, especially our builder box and our ore boxes. They're going to be so much bigger, but as of right now, no. As of right now, they're going to they're gonna stay just about the same. I'm going to go ahead and just put a little bit in between those because I like doing that. Um... Yeah. So we are getting things done. Let's go ahead and go to the base. Let's go to this ammo box. And let's throw in our ammo there. Now I gotta double check things because I just got to. Let's go ahead and auto group all this. Okay, good. I was hoping that it wasn't going to consider this underground and there be an issue there but yeah our cannon should have pretty good range here and I do expect to uh, let me check this one and I do expect to put more out but for right now, we're going to start with two, uh, two 30 mil cannons, basically. That's what we're starting with. Clean that out of there real quick. And let's go ahead and pick, pick a container. We're just going to move all of this so that we can get this out of the way. Good. And just like that, that is out of the way. Now, I was thinking, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. I don't know, guys. Um, trying to think of this front here. I want to use the heavy glass for the front. So I know I want to do that. Exactly how I want to do that. I'm not sure though. So let's go ahead and... Well, oh, we need, the, we need the next level constructor, don't we? Yes, I bet, you, I bet you it takes the advanced constructor to make that heavy glass. And we only have a regular constructor. Uh, let's see here. What does it take to get to an advanced constructor? Upgrade. No upgrade exists. Oh, because we don't have it unlocked. Oh, yes, I remember now. We don't have a lot of stuff unlocked because our level is a bit low. So we need five energy matrixes, ten cobalt alloys, ten flux coils. So... We only have one of those. And of course, we can't make the flux coils because it takes sathium ingots. Okay. That's alright though. That is completely fine. We will get stuff and we will upgrade that eventually. Uh, let's see. Let me... Uh oh. It's already started, guys. Well, hopefully, uh, hopefully we can win. We'll see which direction they come from. Because all I got right now is a regular sniper. They are coming from this direction. No, wait, hold on. East. 
That way? Yeah, they're coming from east. So that's a good, that's a good direction, I think. Yep, I see him. I can only hit him at 129 out. Okay, cannons. There you go. Oh, and they've already started firing. There we go, yeah. Let's stop you from shooting stuff. Yeah. Yay, we won. Alright, did we lose a cannon? No, we did not lose a cannon. Good. Aha! We survived. Yeah, we took a couple hits, but that's alright. I will get them repaired real quick. Ah, wow, we almost lost that block. Yeah, eventually when we get enough uh, hardened steel and cement and all that stuff, we'll come back. I think it's hardened steel. Maybe it's regular steel. Either way, we'll come back and we'll uh, reinforce the whole outside of the building. So that our attack, so that when we get attacked, it's not quite as bad. But yeah, I think our defense has held pretty well right there. I didn't like the fact that I couldn't reach out and help with that tier one sniper though. That was kind of that was kind of disappointing not being able to tag them as soon as I wanted to. Wow, this multi-tool is so slow. We've got to get a tier 2 multi-tool. That's all there is to it. I have got to get a tier 2 multi-tool. Come on. Get it repaired. Well, I am glad that I went ahead and got the uh, cannons down on the base because I actually haven't looked at our base attack numbers. So I don't know how good or bad off we actually are yet. Okay, so nothing got shot there now. I could have swore it shot higher. I don't know. Nope, I really don't know. Okay. So anyway, yay, we survived. <laughs> Let's see, now I think I was going to eat food. Is what I was about to do before we got interrupted. Yes, eat some burgers. Alright, so now... Let's see, what can we do? Um, no, not that, this. Weapons. Give me that, give me that, give me this. And we don't have the stuff for it, okay. Let's see here, go to the base, go to this container, that is a tier 1 sniper, what upgrade kits do we got? We got pistol upgrade, we got a heavy weapons upgrade, we got a rifle upgrade, what weapons are we currently using? 
that's a tier two assault rifle, a shotgun, and a sniper. So I want to take the heavy weapons upgrade. Toss it off in there, and what heavy weapon can I make? I think we can only make the rocket launcher. Yes, because we probably got to have oscillators. Oh, and it's still locked. Okay. Yeah, either way, I think we're going to go ahead and make a rocket because, well, we need we need something that I can reach out there and hit them with. And I'm wondering if the rocket launcher will have enough oomph to get stuff out there. Um, not going to go crazy. We're going to make like five sets of rounds. And until I get a little bit more Promethium because we are kind of running low. Let's see, where are we at on power 7%? Urgh. Okay. Yeah, as soon as we get done with this, I think we're going to have to go raid something. We are most definitely going to have to go raid something. Ah, so frustrated. Okay, where are we at? Yeah, make the heavy weapons. Give me the heavy weapon. And that and that. All right, what is your range? 85 meters. So I can't even use the rocket launcher from the balcony to hit them before they're in range. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're going to need an upgrade kit. We are most definitely going to need an upgrade kit. All right, well, that... That is what it is. Why are my blocks over here damaged? Yeah, okay. I think I'm going to make a handful of blocks to uh, repair this real quick. Actually, I need to see something. Yeah, that's what I thought. I figured we took a hit or two down here. Steel blocks, you gotta love them. All right, speaking of steel blocks, let's run over here. And let's make like 10 blocks to replace what we've lost over here so far. stuff back in here for right now uh, let me see are we missing anything off my device list no okay so everything that got broke was nothing more than steel blocks okay good that is what I wanted to make sure of
Alright, are we solid? Oh, really we're missing one block, two blocks, three blocks. Alright, hold on. Let me make three more blocks. Gotta get the ship back in its original condition. So. Okay. Maybe I did get shot by a rocket launcher. Or by that rocket over here. I don't know. Hey. We're missing more holes here. Or we got more holes here. We're not missing holes. That would be dumb. <laughs> okay, so what do we got? Four more holes? Three more holes. I just want my ship whole again. Whole without holes. That's it. We're good. Okay. Now before I forget, because I always forget this stuff, I need to save this thing as... We're just going to call it the... Project Eden Escape Ship. So, I was asked to get a blueprint of this so that it could be compared to another ship, and I keep forgetting to do that, guys. So, anyway, we're gonna go look for some trouble to get into now, I think. Actually, I need my rockets. Where are my rockets? Here are my rockets. Yes, give me those. Keep that. Drop that off. Um, ammo. Eh, ammo's not too bad. I can use a little bit more. Alright guys, so we're going to do this. I'm going to pause it and I will bring y'all back in just a second. Alright guys, we are back and I just found right down there a captured barge and I have yet to come across one of these and I'm a little bit interested to see what's inside so we're gonna go check out this captured barge if we don't keep hitting trees that are spinning us out of control because I was trying to see if the thing was gonna shoot at us I can't see there's too many trees We're good. Now, the real problem is that uh, it's out on the water, so we're going to have to go out there to it. And unfortunately, the swamp and... Yeah, I see you coming. Between the swamp and the sun. Yeah, I just can't see anything. Alright, well, we're going to go out here a little ways. That didn't work. Yes, hop on the rock. I can't fight you underwater. Oh, this isn't good. This is not good. Stay away.
<laughs> Stupid thing. Now get on the rock. Okay, fine. Don't get on the rock. Well, it looks like we're just going to have to pop up on deck and shoot our way in, I guess. Um. Is it turned off? There's, uh, no power here. Oh, yes, there is. Wait, is there? I don't even know now. Cannot change structure with the multi-tool. Okay, that's fine. Where's the core at, though? No, stop. See, that's the one thing I don't like about the jetpack is if you're swimming, it uses it every time you hit spacebar to go up, and I'm like, just stop doing that. <laughs> oh, I forgot those blow up like that. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> Do not try this at home. Hey, we're right back in the same spot. Awesome. Oh, yeah. Don't do that, guys. Don't do that. That's, uh... Oh, it's been so long. I forget those do that. Okay. Well, now that I've had a good laugh for the day, we can, we can finish raiding stuff, I guess. Yeah, this, uh, this wasn't as cool as I thought it was going to be, honestly. And we can't change it with the multi-tool. Where is the core? Is there a core? Can you even... I don't even know. Well, I would know if I'd have some jetpack to jump up here with. Are these explosive blocks? See, that's steel block. That just says... Mm, I wonder. I'm going to shoot it. <laughs> I'm going to shoot it. We might die again here, guys. Yes. Yes, those are explosive blocks. Okay. 100%. Those are explosive blocks. We have figured that out now. I thought they were. They look like they were. And sure enough, they were. Alright, so those two deaths were for testing purposes only. <laughs> I'm not even upset about it, honestly. I mean, I'm going to be upset when I look at my armor and realize that it's shredded. Yeah, armor shredded. But other than that, no, I'm not really upset. So, barges, not really worth my time, I guess. There's two spawn pads. If you shoot anything, they blow up. So, literally, that's one of those, I guess you just fly over the top of, shoot, and then pick up the boxes, because there was nothing left of that after I shot the ammo box and then that one block. So, yeah, well, it is what it is. 
And now we've learned something. We have learned not to uh, not to shoot stuff that goes boom. Anyway, well, that's going to do it for today's episode, guys. I do hope everybody has enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button. It is an awesome, awesome, awesome way for you to show your support to me, to the channel, to the video, and to the game itself, guys. And as always, feel free to share the video on any social media you're using. Hey guys, just like to stop, take a moment to thank each and every one of y'all for all of your wonderful, awesome support, all the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared, guys. It is awesome, and I do appreciate it. And with that being said, until next time, survivors, keep on surviving.